Welcome back to another episode of A to Z Sports. I'm your host, Ariana Zachary, and as the fall semester is ending, so are the fall sports. But luckily, the spring sports are right around the corner. EW has some very talented sports that you can tune into and follow on. The spring sports wide from women's basketball, men's basketball, baseball, softball, competitive cheerleading, and spring football. Let's all head on to the courts. Up first, we have the women's basketball team, as they have having a pretty good start to their season. They beat Payne College at their last game, making their record 8-4. and four. The team's upcoming game is against St. Thomas University, and they are coached by Ms. Charmaine Wilson, as this is her 11th season coaching the team. The top scorers on the Lady Tigers are Mr. Kwanzaa Brown, Ms. Laquanza Glover, and Mrs. Amari Bell. Here are some highlights from the Lady Tigers games. Next, we have the men's basketball team as they're having an okay start to their season. Their last game, they beat Payne College 88-78, to making their record now 5-4. Their next game is up against Benedict College. The team is coached by Mr. Frederick Summers as this is his fourth season coaching the team. They are led by Mr. Khalil Brown, Mr. Jordan Jackson, and Mr. Elias Harden. Here are some highlights of the men's basketball team from their last games. It's his sixth point on the evening, 41-37, Everett Waters. Here is DeAndre Barton, checked by Feldman, close to the timeline. Now he'll begin to drive, works around a Carlo Brown screen, but Feldman still with that defense now. 13 on the shot clock now. In the lane as Barton had it tipped away. Here comes Will Brown for St. Thomas. Will Brown over to Bryson Wooten. Wooten will try the three. It's good. Bryson Wooten, the freshman for three. Cutting back into the lead. Lead goes under 20. It's 19 now for Allen at 33-14. Right side of People's Banks. Guarded closely by Bryson Wooten. Here's a deep three for Chris Dora. Front of the rim, no good, but into the hands of Eddie Clary. Clary into the lane to Assembly. Assembly is turnaround two. It's no good. Ball tipped around, taken by Khalil Brown. Brown up the floor with the head of steam. Brown will slow things down. Get it over to Knowledge Darby. Darby to Robert Thomas. Thomas to Khalil Brown. Brown in the lane. Brown right hand. Layup off the glass is good. Khalil Brown lays it in. Now off the courts and onto the field with some peanuts and cracker jacks. The men's baseball team season is approaching us soon, and our targets have been practicing hard day and night. They ended their last season with a record of 15 and 26. The schedule for this season is still in the works, but we can't wait to see them back out there on the field. The team is led by Caden Franken, Keelan Washington, and Alexander Davila. The team's head coach is Mr. Reginald Johnson II. We wish the team a good season and good luck on their first game. Here are some highlights from the baseball team.
Since we are still on the field, let's talk about how the Lady Tigers have also been grinding before their season starts. They, e- they ended their st- last season with a record of 19-11. and 11. The team is led by Milani Sablin, Valerie Johnson, and Jasmine Lamug. Their head coach is Mr. Brian Daly. We wish the ladies good luck on their first game and a good season. Here are some highlights from the softball team. Track and Field is having a nice start to their season as they finish second at the Barons Invitational. They are led by head coach Mrs. Latita Parsons Davis as this is her second season coaching the team. We wish the team good luck as they take on their next match. Here are some highlights from the track team. After a good hard cheer for our fall sports, the cheerleading team is getting ready for their cheer competition. This year's cheer team has been filled with fierce chants, acrobatic flips, and enthusiastic cheers. We wish your cheer, cheer, cheer team a good luck as their season of competitive cheerleading approaches. Last but not least, we have spring football, where the players play scrimmage games to better themselves while regular football season has come to an end. Spring games usually start around March, so make sure you tune in. The team will be coached by Mr. Torreno Morgan, which is his first year coaching at Edward Waters University. We hope that you like all the content that we put out here at A to Z Sports, and we have fun doing it. Stay tuned for another episode of A to Z Sports here at Edward Waters University. I'm your host, Ariana Zachary, and let's go Tigers. Enjoy some video clips of the football team as they approach spring football. Thank you.